fantasy requires you to accept the existence of other realities, other worlds, provides an opportunity for spiritual themes to be explored. Certainly the classic works of fantasy, the Tolkienian, C.S. Lewis fantasy, and then a lot of modern fantasy, it's rooted in the idea that there is a spiritual battle, a spiritual world. They all involve that sense of a cosmic conflict, of the reality of invisible forces, of things that can't be explained by the laws of science and the laws of physics. It's that spiritual element that make the stories of Narnia and Middle-earth not just bestsellers, but cultural phenomena that continue to this day. It is a remarkable thing that some of the very best, purely imaginative literature, if you like, fantasy literature, has actually been written by Christians.